is Michelle Taylor from veganbreak.com, and I'm here today with Chloe Coscarelli. Welcome. Thank you. Um, you probably know Chloe from the Food Network's show Cupcake Wars, which she totally dominated with her amazing sure. vegan cupcakes, Thank coming you. in first place. Um, and then, I mean, you've been all over the place on the cover of magazines. Um, you're a contributor to Veg News magazine and New York Times and just all over TV and the internet and everything. Amazing website. Thank you. Yeah. So what inspired you to start it all? Well, I've always loved vegan food and vegan cooking and when I was studying in college, I realized that I was really spending so much more time cooking than I was doing anything else. Um, so when my friends were in the, in the library studying, I would be making them cupcakes and treats and bringing them. <laughs> bringing it to them, so I decided after college to go to culinary school, and at that point, I think that's what really inspired me to, you know, take it all the way and try to share yeah. my recipes with as many people as I could. Definitely, yeah, a lot of my viewers are actually college students and kind of struggling with finding vegan food mm -hmm. in college, so it's very cool that you were able to not only find food, but create your own food. Yeah. What I, was that like? It yeah. was so much fun. I yeah. always say there's no space yeah. too small to cook a feast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In my college apartment, the kitchen was so tiny, like you could barely turn around. And I lived with six girls, so it was just always bustling. Uh -huh. um, but it was really fun. We would throw tempura parties, I would like throw vegan brunch buffets and invite all my friends and all the neighbors to come by. So I found it as a college student as a really great way to make friends and connect with people. And obviously, everyone wants to hang out at your place if you're cooking. Yeah, so definitely. A lot of good memories. Mm -hmm. And I think I read that you're a lifelong vegetarian. Is that true? I uh, went vegetarian as a young child. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, and I did it because I really loved it. Yeah. And I always, we'd always had adopted dogs, and I just, it didn't seem right for me to yeah. be eating animals and also loving them as my pets. Yeah. So um, I went vegetarian, and I loved it. And I felt like I was eating. Food than anything, yeah. Um, just because you know, you can only have so much cheese pizza, or grilled right. cheese, and quesadillas. It was like you know, the food yes. was more exciting when it was vegan. Yeah. Um, so that's when I decided to take the plunge and go vegan all the way. So we're here today at Chloe's book signing in San Francisco for her brand new cookbook, yes. which is really exciting. Congratulations. Thank you. Um, this. Just looking through it, the it has like incredibly colorful photographs and just like beautiful design, and the recipes are pretty simple and doable by even like novice chefs. So it's so cool, and congratulations again. Thank you so much. I'm really excited about it. Uh, like you said, I worked really hard to make the recipes extremely easy, uh -huh. accessible, everyday ingredients, and tons of photos because that's always my favorite part of a cookbook. Yeah, that's um, what I always say. Like I'm not inspired to actually make it unless I can you see have it in the picture. Because once you see it, you can really taste it. Yeah. Uh, so I really hope you guys enjoy it. Yeah, you should definitely check it out. So thank you so much, Chloe. Thank you. Everyone, be sure to pick up a copy of her cookbook and visit your fabulous website, www.chefchloe.com. Thank you so much. This was so fun. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.